Light is everywhere. We use it to see the amazing world around us. There are so many different sources of light. A torch. Light bulbs. And, of course, the sun. But remember, never look directly at the sun. It is very bad for your eyes and can possibly make you go blind. First of all, can you see this little yellow dot in the middle of this torch? Well, that is the source of light, the light bulb. As you can see, most of the light is coming from that yellow dot. Isn't that interesting? Let's get on to the next topic. Shadows. First of all, we need to work out how shadows work. But before we do that, I want to show you something really cool that I found out. When I turn this torch on, it creates a rainbow on the outside. Isn't that amazing? For our shadow experiment today, I am going to be using this peg and a few other items. When we turn the torch on, you can still see a bit of the rainbow, but now, can you notice the shadow? Yes, it's over here, and we've even got a shadow of my fingers too. But the main question is, how does a shadow work? First of all, light travels in straight lines, no matter what. The only reason we can see light is because light reflects off of objects around us and goes through our pupils. Also, did you know that your pupils are actually a hole in your eye? Yes, you have a hole in your eye. And the reason why shadows are here are because when the light tries to travel in straight lines this object the peg is in the way so that means that the shape that the object is in is going to be the shape of the patch of light that does not come through in addition when you move the light closer to the object the object stretches and gets bigger and when you move it back it gets smaller. Do you know why? Are you ready? The reason it gets bigger when the light source gets closer is because the light source cannot shine light through if it's very close. For example, there is no light if I do this because it is really close to the floor but if I do this you can see a lot of light because the light source is getting further and further away I hope you have found out a lot about light and shadows today remember to subscribe to my channel for more amazing science experiments like these bye